Hey guys, Michael and Damon here from Stempunks. So we're gonna give you a bit of a product review today on the MBOT from MakeBlock. Yeah, so this is a great little robot that you can use in classes. And I've seen this being used in the classroom classroom from as little as year two, going right up into, into um, secondary school. Now, the way they're so easy that we've used them as educators is that they're really easy to code. Students can put them together really well. And yeah, they're pretty, they're pretty robust. Uh, I've seen one fly across the room and it still worked, put it that way. And they're a great platform because as Damien said, you can use this from the lower grades of primary school all the way up to secondary. There's a very scalable system. So when you start off with this uh, platform, you might start with things like visual block coding to get into coding and then you start moving and transitioning to um, more syntax based coding. Yep. And also in terms of that, that's a really good differentiator because in your terms of um, your block coding, I've seen three and four use block coding, oh, well primary school use block coding, and then obviously you can change it up for when you get into secondary. So therefore this, this system can be used right through this one product, can be used as your robotics program throughout the whole school. Yeah. And also that, when you get up in the grades, you want to make it more advanced for the students too. It comes with some pretty cool sensors too. So we've got things like ultrasonic sensors. So I've got one set up right there. We have another one here, which got the line follow underneath. So you can do pretty sophisticated programs with this too and start to make it a bit more challenging for the students. And another thing we love about this platform too is that since such a robust chassis in this, and it's all aluminium chassis in here, you can 3D print things too. If you go to 3D printer, you want to do more design work with, you want to custom designs, you can add that to this platform too. So it's a very robust and a very scalable system. Yep, cost. Cost for this thing here, range from about $160, $150 plus GST. You shouldn't pay more than that. Uh, they come in a few different variants. This one here is the standard one, which comes with the ultrasonic sensor and the line follower. And you can buy add-ons like this little LED display here, but about 150, 160 bucks for one of these. See, that's reasonable. And that's mm. reasonable for a school too, because realistically, I could see that you would need around no less than eight for a whole school system, or a whole school for a class program. So anyway, that's how we see it. I think it's a pretty great little program. I think you're gonna be able to use it throughout all your year levels. Yes, and just before we go too, um, in terms of how you code these platforms, right? So you can both use tablets. So if you've got the uh, Apple tablets, you've got the Android tablets, you can use software to program them on tablets. If you've got PCs, you can use PCs as well. And a bit more technical, the way they work, they use either Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, and you can buy them with either options. It's a very, very customizable system. Yeah, nice. Mm. nice. Brilliant. All right, I reckon that's it. Come and check out our other programs, especially the robot program. We'll be using these systems in more detail. But for now, bye from Stempunks. See you later on.